In the fall of 2015, as a birthday gift, my parents took me up for my 16th birthday to see the Ronald Reagan Library. At the time, uh, somebody who was just familiarizing themselves uh, with the democratic process, it really was inspiring to see not only the Gipper's legacy, but the Republican Party's influence uh, in times of adversity like the Cold War. Since that time, we have seen what I've a realization of a different kind of Republican Party, one that stands in stark contrast to that beautiful museum up in the hill uh, in Simi Valley. But we've seen beginning in 2016 when the president, first then candidate, first mocked John McCain as a war hero, later mocked disabled people, later attacked uh, just about every value we have was a divergent path between the Republican Party of John McCain, of Ronald Reagan, of so many other people, and a new kind of sinister uh, party. So looking forward to this election, it's exciting. It's my first time voting in a presidential election, as it is many others. But for many young conservatives, I think the tide has turned in favor of not this candidate. Uh, and I think we're in a position where we must vote for Joe Biden. As a Nevadan, uh, it became increasingly clear the lack of responsiveness of President Trump um, in the 2017 after the Las Vegas shooting that killed over 50 uh, Las Vegans and, and people around the country um, right here. The lack of gun control and the lack of efforts of any conservatives just to come together on common ground um, is something that Nevadans have not forgotten. We need a president who is going to take responsibility, reach bipartisan consensus, um, and make sure that uh, tragedies like this don't happen. These kind of values are things that of bipartisanship, something that Joe Biden will do good at. It's something that other Republicans in the past, whether George Bush Sr., whether President Reagan, uh, backed even to Eisenhower, have championed. And that's something that I hope that um, we'll be seeing more of is coming together to solve problems, even if they're contentious matters like gun control, um, coming together and finding solutions for them. But I really do think that Nevadans, young people, people voting for the first time really only have one choice. And we cannot, we cannot put this circus back in front and center for another four years. Nevadans can't take it. We've seen the devastation to the Nevada economy, highest unemployment in the country, um, the recklessness of the past four years is making its impression here. And we need the people who will come in um, and bipartisan uh, and restore the values, not only the country, but also help the Republican Party put itself back together. And Donald Trump is not that candidate. So as a student, uh, as a young conservative, uh, we are looking forward to uh, Joe Biden come next couple of years working to put America back into shape, fixing the economy uh, and lifting us all up with them.